We are back out at Valley Axe. There's always lots happening out here. And one of the things that is involved with Valley Axe is uh, giving back into the community. And if you see behind me here right now, 16 volleyball teams are here today for a very special reason. It's called Talk for Tamara. And we're going to talk with uh, one of the committee members, Kelly Steves. Thanks yes. for being here. Yeah, thank you, David, for coming out. Yeah, this is really a fantastic uh, story that came together in last, like, just two weeks this thing was put yeah. together. About four weeks ago, uh, two of Tamara's friends approached Lori about putting on a volleyball tournament for Tamara's friends and supporters. And within four weeks, between Lori and these girls, they have pulled together 115 kids are playing, right. six teams, yeah. beautiful weather. Now let's talk about, yeah, let's okay. talk about why this is happening and, and let's introduce Lori here and who she is. Yeah, so this is Lori Lumley. Uh, we were brought together when tragedy hit on October the 25th mm -hmm. of last year. She lost her daughter and so uh, Tamara had trouble talking with people and sharing what she was feeling like. So Lori and her skating coach Sonia Rivard came up with the name Talk for Tamara. So uh, we are going to raise some funds in support of uh, education for youth around mental illness and uh, suicide prevention because we don't want to see any child to suffer like that or any parent yeah. or family member to go through something now, like this, this is, again. This is something that's uh, affected our community in, in several different ways. Um, but specifically, this money is to uh, support in the high schools, right? Because is there is there lacking services there? There's definitely lack of services there. We're hoping to have a pilot project, but we're just in the... Um, early stages of making a proposal to the school board to start. Right. So, so this isn't just, uh, hey, we're going to take this money and tell some people what they need to do. There's actually a whole organization working yes. on this, mm -hmm. structured, and then moving forward, uh, hopefully growing to support uh, many other youth in, in the high schools. Correct. Yeah, right. Talk for Tamara has been successful. Um, you know, we had our spring skate. Uh, for mental health. Uh, we've had some other fundraisers, and so we do. We're with the Sarnia Community Foundation. Yep. We're under their umbrella. So we do have some funds, but right now we're researching, collaborating, talking with people in mental health, the school board level, students, yeah. parents, to make sure that we get a plan that's going to really see some change yeah. with the youth of our community. It really does have to start with talking, right? So uh, really an appropriate title for the event today. Yes. And, and as a parent, You've got to feel pretty good about seeing the response out here today. It was amazing. Yeah. In less than a week, we had 115 players and 16 teams registered with a waiting list. Right. So play. we're going to have to get Bo at Valley Axe to build more courts for next year. <laughs> yeah, right? yes. He's got room out there. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Yes, thank you definitely. both so much oh, uh, thank for you, talking David. with us today and your efforts and the committee mm -hmm. efforts. And uh, we'll keep following up with you at some other fundraisers that you're probably going to have coming up. Yes. All right? Okay, thanks, okay, David. Valley Axe here today. You can come out and watch all these teams that are supporting Talk for Tamara. For the show live on location, I'm David Burroughs. Thanks for watching.